Hard bicycle business is through the roof at one local shop, but they aren't selling new rides. They're fixing the old ones. News 3 reporter Kofo Lasaki now with how the pandemic has quadrupled business at one Portsmouth store. That part is yeah. a little bent at the moment. Another broken bicycle is rolling into scat bikes in need of some repairs. Folks discovered they couldn't go to their gyms or couldn't go hang out with their friends. They started to find ways to, to get outside and bicycles make a lot of sense. People are pedaling their way through the pandemic, and many of them eventually end up here. We, we definitely see a little bit of everything. A little bit is an understatement. Nothing out here is for sale. I wish it was. <laughs> the bikes on the floor, the bikes on the rack, even the ones on the wall, they're all customer repairs. We may have 25 to 30 bicycles uh, for repair in at a time and we can usually get them completed within four or five days. Uh, right now we have uh, over 100 bikes. It was about 125 at last count. Customers bought up almost all of the new bikes and now the showroom is a storage room for bicycles that are waiting to be fixed. They're just pulling bikes out that haven't been used in a few years or they are using them and finding that the bikes need a little further adjustment. To avoid some common problems, owner Brian Morey says riders should make sure tires are properly filled with air. You'll also want to oil the chains every several weeks, and if you start to hear noises that you're not accustomed to, it's probably time to take it in. If they've been sitting for 10 or 20 years, then they may not, may not work when you pull them out. It's an unlikely pandemic problem, but one that Mari is happy to fix. Everybody really seems to be enjoying their bikes, and I'd, I'd love to see that you know, continue into the future, even after everything's all said and done. In Portsmouth, Kofo Lasaki, News 3.